Grace, you startled me. Miss Paula, it's the middle of the cotton picking night. Where are you running to, child? Why, Grace, what makes you think I'm running? Child, I'm from a family of slaves done run whenever they legs are left. I always seen it in my brother's eyes before they run. I seen it for Elroy run. I seen it in both. And I seen it in my own eyes in the middle. Right before I wrote from you and Massa last spring. So I know by looking, you was gonna run. Besides, you got two suitcases there. Oh, oh, Grace, you are wise. I hope to be as wise if I live as long. Child, I'm the same age as you. You be this wise looking too if you down on your knees scrubbing the damn floor. Now listen, I know why you run. I know you go look for your boy Jack. But Jack is dead, child. You're dead. <laughs> the way you gonna go find him at? If he said I will go to where the dead congregate, I will go to Rhode Island. <laughs> Gee, Rhode Island? Gee, some things just ain't worth it, child. <laughs> Maybe you've never been in love. Oh, maybe you're right. Maybe if I was born stupid as you, I'd fall in love and say some shit like that. <laughs> <laughs> you wanna go get bit by a vampire? That's your problem. You call it love, the doctor call it crazy. I call it dumb stupid. <laughs> but maybe some people, some people out there, where you going, their people call it liberty. So maybe that's what you're looking for. Maybe someday I'll go there and maybe meet you and look for it myself. Goodbye, old Grace. Or maybe they catch you, beat the shit out of you, and I'll see you here tomorrow. Nobody at old Grace is me. <laughs> well, you just take care of your young, sweet, healthy, rich, Definitely white silk. <laughs> she hands Paula a magical horn. <laughs> Man trying rape you. You just blow this horn off. And the spirit will come rescue you. But don't you blow it unless in your ring. Grace.